Hey yo, what's up guys? Welcome to Damsawa Media and Inspirational World. Today I'm going to take you through an F-sharp advanced uh, worship progression. And in this case, I'm going to take a very simple progression of one, four, one, five in worship. There is someone who requested this tutorial a couple of um, months ago. Guys, as you know, I've been away for a while, uh, but I'm trying to uh, adjust my schedule because of some few things one or two things i'm working on to make sure that uh, these tutorials are consistent at least every day uh if not uh, at least two weeks in a week thank you so much guys and uh, this is psrs x 600 uh, the keyboard that i'm using and uh, my settings i've selected right one uh, concert grant I've selected concert grant as you can see on the screen and then uh, on right to I've selected uh, suitcase I like this combination of voices right one and two and I believe uh, this will help you for those of you who may want maybe to uh, perfect your playing to the next level I'll be going to uh, begin from a very simpler way of playing one four one five progression in your worship okay before adding anything else as you know guys i always teach in numbers we call it the nashville number system i always work in numbers whenever i teach now these tutorials and one by one this is one on f sharp there is no need of going back explaining uh the do re mi fa sol la ti do of the f sharp major scale uh, because if you check uh, from my tutorials, there are several tutorials from beginner's perspective explaining uh, the solfa notation, the notes of F sharp, major scale, and uh, whatever. Okay, this is one. That, 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 that's four. Then back to one. Then five. I'm doing this because... Uh, of some of you who may want maybe to know uh, the uh, genesis of all these things, the progression and how it came about. This is just a simple progression before I'm going to uh, improve it uh, in a more advanced uh, manner. Now, that's one. Four. And back to one. And then five. Huh? All right, now we are going to uh, do this way. We are going to start with one. We are going to do something like this. On my left hand, I'll be playing one, a chord one, that's F sharp, uh, C sharp, and F sharp, uh, the other octave. And remember on my right hand, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be moving on uh, F sharp major ninth chord. Then I'll be coming, I'll be playing this chord on my right hand. Okay, let's interpret it. That's a C sharp, uh, let's interpret it. Let's interpret it, just a minute, let's interpret it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are going to play that uh, this way. One, and use this chord as a passing chord. C sharp minor. But I'm always adding my seconds in my playings, uh, most of the times. Then we go to four. Then uh, we go to G diminished. That will take us to two. Okay, that's two. And we call it a G sharp minor. Then we go to another chord. Uh, which, which is uh, C sharp or, or you can call it uh, okay this is a G sharp not a C sharp 
this is a G sharp major uh, that will take you back to one over five. Repeat again. This is this is the kind of movement that I'm doing on my left hand. I'm just moving from one, then to three, then to four, two, then I'll be I'll be also adding flat five that will take me to five, then back five, then back to one. And on my right hand, I'm doing this very slowly uh, because I like um, my tutorials are always slowly. So you can understand everything that I, I want to be explaining here. Okay. Now this is how I'm playing my one. You can also invite your F sharp major nine. You can, uh, you can play this way. You can invert it that way. Okay. So mm -hmm. then do that uh, movement from note four, three, and two. Play a C sharp dominant seven as your chord five. Where is on your left hand will be playing a C sharp major as your chord five, then back to one. So very slowly, there, there are several things that I'm going to add. Uh, I just request that you be uh, much keen uh, so you capture everything. And play uh, E major instead of going back to uh, one and start all over again from one four you can start from uh, E major then then You can also do this. Uh, you can move from F sharp then you can move from F sharp then uh, D major then C sharp minor our, four, our fourth chord that is a uh, B major then G diminished, then our chord two, then one over five, then five. 
And this is the kind of movement that you'll be combined with. If you start with one, yeah. okay, let's see how it's gonna sound like, man. Uh huh, let's start. Uh huh. I'll be playing chord two on my left hand. Okay. Thank you so much guys god bless you so much thank you for watching continue subscribing a journey to 10k subscribers